Welcome friends. It's election season. All parties are in campaign mode and that means accusations galore. From who else? Our country's star campaigner, Prime Minister Modi. Who is in a habit of making exaggeration, saying half-truths, sometimes lies. Yes, this happened last Tuesday during a rally in Tonk, Madhya Pradesh, where PM Modi was addressing an election rally. During his speech, he said that Congress has given reservation on the basis of religion. He gave example of Andhra Pradesh and Karnataka. He said Congress has snatched away reservation from SCST and giving it to Muslims. He goes further and says that Congress is the biggest enemy of OBCs. They have added all Muslims to the OBC category. This is a pilot project that is being done in Karnataka and it will be implemented everywhere. Congress government Karnataka mein jitne bhi Muslim samaj ke log hai, ucch var ke honge, dhani honge, vyapari honge, udhyaprati honge, nyay murti honge, koi bhi honge, bas sirf wo musalman hona chahiye. Agar wo musalman hai, to unhone rato rat ek kagaj nikal kar hastakshar karke un sab ko does a Prime Minister not know the history of Karnataka? Let's do some fact check on PM Modi's speech. PM Modi said that present Congress government is giving reservations to Muslims. It is snatching reservations from SCST and giving it to Muslims. And it is also snatching reservation from OBCs and giving it to Muslims. First of all, it is not Congress that gave reservations to Muslims. The Muslim community was given reservation way back in 1921 as a backward class community following the recommendation of Justice Miller Committee appointed by then Maharaja of Mysore in 1918. This committee found that there is an actual situation of over-representation of Brahmins in education and government positions and the non-representations of other communities. The first in the series of such commissions was Naganna Gora Commission in 1961 and it brought Muslims under the backward classes list. It identified more than 10 castes within Muslims as most backward. Post-independence period, we see a series of efforts to include Muslims under sections of the backward classes quota by several commissions like the Havanur Commission by Devraj Ars government in 1975 and Chinnappa Reddy Commission in 1990. When Mandal Commission was implemented, the reservations for Muslims was reduced from 6% to 4% to accommodate into the 50% reservation limit. And this was done under the chief ministership of H.D. Devagoda. Yes, the JDS Supremo, who is now a close ally of BJP in this election. In 2023, Baswaraj Bomai government undemocratic ordered to do away with Muslim reservation to stir communal polarization. But the Supreme Court intervened and called it prima facie shaky and flawed and stopped its implementation. So, dear viewers, when did the reservation for Muslims start in Karnataka? Yes, in 1921, during the time of Mysore King Krishnaraj Wadayar. Now BJP has given ticket to a member of the same Wadayar family for the Karnataka election, Yaduvir Wadayar. Should PM Modi not know the history of this royal family and their contribution to the Karnataka society? Krishnaraj Wadayar implemented reservations during British time and Muslims have been put under reservation because they were economically and socially backward. Secondly, any final decision on SCST reservation can only be taken by the parliament, not by the state governments. This is also something that PM Modi should have known. Now, some people have confusion on basic things like if reservation is given on the basis of caste or religion. When we say schedule caste and schedule tribes, it includes caste and tribes that have and continue to face untouchability. There is no such thing as backward caste reservation. When we say OBC, it means other backward classes, not other backward castes. Hans Raj Ganga Ram Ahir, who is the chairman of National Commission of Backward Classes, has also said that in Karnataka all Muslims are put under OBC category. 
here also muslims are put in the obc category as economically and socially backward class not on the basis of caste or religion it is noteworthy that mr hansraj ahir is also a bjp leader so muslim reservation started in karnataka in 1921 under the rule of mysore king krishnaraj wadeyar and it was continued by all subsequent governments when it was revised who was in power hd devagoda and devraj ars not the present congress government for more such videos and discussion please like share and subscribe edina.com mattashtu vishesha video galannu nodalu mattu hosa video gala bagge tiliyalu edina.com youtube channel subscribe maadi mattu bell icon click maadi